Some in excess for you. It's Grand Prairie's Classic Rock and More 104.7 Free FM. 20 minutes before 9 o'clock on this Thursday morning, July 21st. And this weekend, it's the annual Street Performers Festival. Of course, last year turned out to be pretty fun. Expecting more of the same this year. And in studio is a man performing a miracle with a toy I used to have as a young child. This is... Lee Zimmerman, the Etch-A-Sketch Man. How are you, sir? I'm very happy. How are you? You're drawing a picture of me on an Etch-A-Sketch. My, my first question is, don't you have to be careful when you lift those things up? Don't Once you pick them up, don't they erase the whole picture? Isn't they, that how those things work? They do, and that's one of the coolest features about it. It's impermanent. you gotta, <laughs> you got to be really careful. It's just like a marriage. So I, you've, you brought in a booklet of some of your work. Yeah. Are you going to be out all weekend long, or are you going to be out Friday through Sunday? Yes, I will, and I'll be doing both the Etch-A-Sketch Guy and my classic rock rock and roll puppet show. And we got to talk about that in a second here, but let's talk about your Etch-A-Sketching sure. skills. Okay, now I remember these Etch-A-Sketch. For kids who are listening now, if there are kids listening now, get them out of the room. Don't let kids <laughs> listen to this morning show. Please. But, yeah, but, if there, but if you're a kid now, you probably don't even know what an Etch-A-Sketch is. But if you're old like me, you remember this toy. You sit there, and I was able to sometimes maybe manage to draw a circle. And then I'd be proud of myself and run off to show my mom. You are doing a fully detailed drawing of me. You've got the beard. You've got the microphone. I'm even working on your T-shirt right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's there amazing. You go. And, and as you look through your, uh, you've got your folder that you brought in with all your work. I mean, you're doing... Full, you know, if, if people bring down a picture of their dead mother-in-law, you will actually be able to draw that on an Etch-A-Sketch. Yes, exactly. And pets, anything you anything you want to see, I'll do for you. And as quickly as I can. I might not be the best. There's others. There are others. I'm definitely the fastest. But how do you... Now, so what happens after that? Obviously, people can't walk away with the Etch-A-Sketch and take it home with them, right? They can, and there's ways you can display them. And there is a way to make them permanent, but I just resent that. <laughs> So if somebody wants to get a picture drawn on issues, they can actually purchase it from you and take it home with them? Absolutely, and I'm selling them, too, just for the toys, because they notice you don't have that just sketches available around here. Isn't that have weird? cases of them. You would think that everybody would have an Etch-A-Sketch. Uh, you you really should. You know what? And It's the quietest toy you can buy in Mom and Dad. <laughs> What do you really want to have them uh, have no imagination, tell them what the character looks like, and make a bunch of beeping noises in the back of the car? Or they're very quiet Etch-A-Sketch. Listen. <laughs> I would imagine you had a lot of spare time in your life to be able to learn to draw on an Etch-A-Sketch like My this. My entire life is devoted to spare time. Thank you for <laughs> noticing. Yes, and if you want to be good at Etch-A-Sketch, kids, ignore your teachers, sit in the back of the classroom, <laughs> put the math book up on its side, and hide behind it. You'll do great. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Let me see what you've got there so far. So far, we're up to this. Look at this! Did you get a picture of this guy? We're filming this. By the way, if you'd like to see the Etch-A-Sketch Man, he is on our uh, on our video, uh, on our website, www.1047freefm.com. Just click on the video stream, and you can watch this happening as it happens right here. He is drawing a picture of me. It's absolutely incredible. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> now, as uh, you should mention also, you've got the uh, the puppet show, and you've got characters like Jimi Hendrix. T tell me about this rock and roll puppet show you got going on. Well, Hendrix is the most important thing, but i got Tina Turner, Elvis <laughs> Presley, Homer Simpson on drums, Christina Aguilera. You couldn't come up with a rock and roll drummer. You had to put Homer in there? I needed a Homer Simpson. I based it my entire life on his teachings. <laughs> Uh, you know, the entire show started in Los Angeles, California. Okay. And it's just got that L.A. feel to it. You're going to like it, man. I can't wait to see this. And that's going to be part of the show all weekend, too, right? I'm going to set up a booth that's Etch-A-Sketch on one side and Papa Guy on the other side so that I'm always doing something. I'm never going to take a day off. I yeah, promise. I mean, no breaks, either? No, no, no. No I'm, toilet breaks. I'm very studious. That's right. <laughs> Tell me about the puppet show. So is that the, is that the main characters right you there? you got to see the Hendrix because his fingers move on the neck of the guitar. He plays these mini, mini marshals. He breaks them up in little pieces. I was going to ask if you lit him on fire. I don't light him on fire, but he <laughs> does play with his teeth. That's awesome. you got to come to the States on July 4th. That's when I light the guitar on fire. I really do. <laughs> the whole bit. Yeah, I really do. <laughs> if anybody's trying to get into learning to do some sort of street performance like this, do you encourage that? I mean, it's a it's No, a I discourage it. Why on earth would I give away the few gigs that I can <laughs> muster up? No. Uh, there are There is a new generation coming up. Actually, matter of fact, we have a few of them coming up at this festival. Shea Hooray is a newcomer. Uh, Brian, Magic Brian, who does this great character, Nigel Hawthorne. You're going to love that guy. Really, really funny. Newcomers. So there are some newcomers. People are fun in the, the uh, art form. And, the, and you've been traveling around Alberta now for the last few days, right? Did you just fly up from Los Angeles in the last week or so? I've been here for three weeks. I was in St. Albert. I was uh, again in Edmonton last week, and then I'm here now. And I'll be back next week uh, for Sherwood Park. Yeah, I do a bunch of stuff in Alberta. One of my favorite places in the entire world. Canada. 
Greatest country in the world. I guess you already knew that. Canada, eh? Yeah. That's right. Why do you think I came up here to get away from those hot, blistering summers and experience the joy of cold winters? Yeah. Nine Why months would you out of the year. You want to see a bikini every no, day. No, you don't want to. It gets old. Year. It's very, yeah. very boring. It's tiresome. <laughs> Lee Zimmerman, one of the many artists who will be performing at the Street Performers Festival, he is making an amazing drawing of me on Etch a Sketch. And uh, again, you will be able to see this on our website later. We'll post the video. And you can go on webcam right now and uh, experience. The joy of Etch-A-Sketch, and again, this is the perfect toy for your kids. It's an inspiration <laughs> for the next generation. So nice meeting you, man. Nice to meet you, too, Lee. Come down to the Street Performers Festival. It starts off tomorrow at 4 in the afternoon, runs all the way through the weekend. Don't miss it, and I'll be down there, too. Uh, I want to I want to watch the puppet show. Can I touch the puppets? Yeah, by all means, you can try the puppets. I, I like you. I the puppets. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Check it out. It's all weekend long. More details on our website, www.1047freefm.com. It's 846, music on the way from State of Shock. And again, Lee Zimmerman, thanks so much for joining us in studio. Real pleasure. Thanks, man.